What is up, guys? We are back with some more Pokemon Sword. We got our gym uh, badge, and we challenged uh, Hop to another battle, beat his butt, and now we are on Route 9, um, not really knowing what Pokemon to expect. I actually forgot to heal up my team. I went and went to a different town just because I felt like I didn't talk to people at a certain town. But we're going to start off with Grimmsnarl because I want to show off Grimmsnarl to you guys because he evolved last episode. I'm still wondering when we get to um, ride our bike on water. Because at this rate, I feel like I'm not even going to get the, the Milotic I want for my team. Okay, yeah, he really is hairy. Okay, we'll do Spirit Break. Oh, you didn't know I'm dark and fairy. <laughs> okay, that did a lot of damage. Special attack fell. Okay. I didn't even read that it lowered special attack. I just thought it was a physical move. Wait, doesn't... Oh, Aqua Jet just makes it so Sucker Punch doesn't do a darn thing. <laughs> Yeah, that would have been the time to use Sucker Punch. I thought she was going to do Crunch twice in a row. Well, if we come into contact with Fighting type, this will be interesting to see. Hopefully we can go like up against the champ just so we can kick its butt. <laughs> a Lantern. Rillaboom. You know what to do, bro. Bulldoze. Yeah, you got nothing for me, buddy. Again, I'm, I'm still happy with my decision to choose grass. And now I low-key feel like the grass Pokemon is more OP than the other starters. <laughs> Did you guys see her face at the end, though? Pelipper. I would get that Pokemon, but I don't really see myself doing anything with it for real, for real. I think in the end I will end up just coming back and catching as many Pokemon as I don't have on my team, like Endgame, just because it'll be easier to catch them all too. Especially with, uh, wow, this is uh, Galarian Darumaka. Wow, uh, wasn't expecting that. <laughs> why does why does everybody use a dark move on him? Does does he have an ability that makes people want to use dark moves? <laughs> I feel like if I'm outspeeding, then there's no point in me using Sucker Punch. I do need to use a Draining Kiss, though. Oh, maybe another time. Because I think... I think I... I think I'm thinking of the right Pokemon <laughs> that's about to come out. Yeah. I haven't seen a Blossom in so long. Oh, 
Oh yeah, Toxtricity learned a new move, by the way, um, when he hit level 44. It's called Overdrive. I think I'll actually um, use him in like the next battle just to show you guys what that move looks like. Because I haven't even used the move yet either. And I'm kind of itching to see how to move a guitar reference. Or type... Oh wow, we're about to double battle? There's no way we're letting you anywhere near Spike Month, and that means we can't let you go on to Route 9. It's Team Yells did to cheer on these lovely Dreadna. And we also get to stop people from heading out over the water. Yes, I understand. All I'm saying is that I can make it so that Rotom Bikes can ride on water. Oh, I was just asking about this. Why? We meet again, my young gym challenger friend. Remember me? I gave you that bike, so do you think you could do me another favor and teach these ruffians a lesson or two? It's our duty to protect Dread Gnaw. That means you're gonna need to give up on the gym challenge. You look like you need convincing, so how about a Pokemon battle? I'll send you packing for the sake of Dread Gnaw, of course. Okay, maybe I can replace Gyarados with the Feebas Milotic or whatever later on. Something tells me they're gonna get Toxtricity on their team just because the music, the battle music that they get. Yeah, so let's check out Overdrive, which is also a special, special attack, a special um, electric attack. Hey, he actually did a guitar strum. <laughs> Pangoro, um, Grimmsnarl, I think this is going to be my chance to use Draining Kiss, to be honest, since Pangoro is also fighting, this should be like a times four. How does it feel to get kissed by a gremlin, though? <laughs> yeah, there we go. Okay, yeah, Grimmsnarl is definitely staying on the team. And normally when I do my Pokemon playthroughs, I try to have a Dragon-type Pokemon. Oh, Woodhammer, what? What? Oh, man, I don't want to get rid of Drum Beating, though, because... That's literally like his iconic... Let's get rid of Knockoff. I don't really have him go up against certain Pokemon for that dark um, type-up matchup. But Woodhammer's going to be good to have. Even though we're going to get that recoil on it when we use it, it's still good to have. I remember having that on my Torterra back in the day. Uh, I want to go back to Spike Month. I really do. So now we get to battle the other one. Ha! He's going to ride the Dreadnought. Boy, I've got an idea. We can get on Dreadnought first and ride it away. Alright, get a move on Dreadnought. See you later, Gym Challenger. Are they really going to climb on Dreadnought? Or is he going without them? <laughs> Seems you've come to my aid yet again. How's that cycling life been treating you? Are you having fun? Wouldn't it be great if you could ride your Rotom bike on the water too? Then I'm going to add these special parts allowing it to travel along the water surface just for you. Appreciate it. You put the Rotom bike in your bag. All right, all right. With the Rotom bike water mode, you'll cruise across the water like a Pokemon with Swift Swim. By the bike riding on land, we'll call it land mode. Whoa. What is that? What is that? Don't tell this is a trainer. No, this is a Pokemon. Graplock? Oh, shoot. If this is a good water Pokemon, I might... 50. Good thing we can catch Pokemon up to level 50. Oh, wait. It's... It took, like, a little bit of regular damage? We're gonna use Toxic. So I wanna catch this actually. I 
I don't know if we'll... Wow, you know, super power. I'm pretty sure it's not going to capture it just because we're under leveled. Octo lock? It's like bind? Oh, it's like mean look, basically. I guess it wasn't meant to be to capture him, though, because it lowers. Wait, why did my. Why did all that get lowered? I don't get it. Dang. Now it's like I... I'm pretty sure Toxic's about to take him out. <laughs> to capture that Pokemon. So now I feel like I need to go see what its typing is. Maybe I passed it up. <laughs> I don't know, maybe I didn't pass it up. I don't know. Well, no use in looking for it now I guess but that Pokemon did look pretty nice didn't it um I really wanted to know what its typing was because that electric attack wasn't super effective on him but let me let me revive my boy Toxtricity he didn't deserve to go out like that because I was just trying to catch a Pokemon Okay, Wilmer. Oh, snap. Oh, it's another one. I like how almost fluid it runs with going back to, like, land. I don't know, normally when I play Pokemon games um, that require like me surfing around and stuff, I try not to even battle the trainers. I wonder if it'll tell me it's type now. If, um, if I do info. Oh, you're just a, you're not even, wow, you're just a fighting type. That's actually kind of smart for it to look like a water Pokemon and then He's a fighting type, but I guess it makes sense because it looks like he's wearing like a luchador mask in a sense with its color scheme. Yeah, you're too late. I already used Toxic, bro. Overdrive, buddy. Oh, that was all you had. Yeah, he looked kind of hurt by that loss. Actually, no, I kind of want Grim Grimmsnarl out there. In case this is a double battle. 
Okay, yeah, it wasn't. They just complained that it's too cold. What's this way? Oh, there's a tent over there. Easy peasy lemon squeezies. Just because y'all got fighting Pokemon out here. Punched him right in the gut. And now we can use Draining Kiss just to be able to take another fighting move. So we're gonna get all of that. And then I think Hale will take him out. Oh yeah, especially because you wasted time using bulk up. You should, probably should have used bulk up first and then attack. figure out what Pokemon that is oh okay so this is the pre-evolution for um that Grapplock Grapplock I know this is gonna hurt you buddy you might even faint yep But okay, they made a nice, a nice fighting type. I'm not even gonna lie, that's pretty nice looking. Let me just put Toxtricity back out there. Something tells me she's gonna have like a lantern or something. Oh, Quillfish, my other least favorite. I don't know, I kind of want to keep Flame Charge, but I feel like Heat Crash will be good because he's a heavy Pokemon. And I don't think I use Incinerate that often like that. But I also have Ancient Power on the team, so... Either way, I'll still have like a move to use for Special Attacking. That's kind of what I was worried about because I think Special Attacking is what 
Carcoal is better at? Piyumaku? I don't ever really remember learning this Pokemon's type. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> totally forgot about that ability. You got spiky Pokemon on purpose though? This is quite the route. I'm not even gonna lie, like I wanna get I wanna battle all these trainers just to show you guys what these what Pokemon they have and also if we can like see some new Pokemon showcased out here. Oh you got cloister. I really could just be using Discharge, but I don't know if I'm going to have to do like a double battle or something. And if Toxtricity was going to go out there and do a double battle, I'd probably have him do double battles with, um, with Rillaboom or Karkul, to be honest. Yeah, you may be rested up. I think she used a dive ball to catch her Pokemon too. You come out with a Remoraid? kind of good like this gives you like an area where you can level up your team a bit and finally face more water Pokemon I think starting off with the grass starter we didn't really face enough water Pokemon but then it's like at this point I have an electric type that can just zap all of them to death Tried it. Do we make it to where we... Okay, yeah. We're just gonna get this battle because I don't know if I'll come back to like this water area and do all these battles or not. Toxapic, okay. This was my go-to Pokemon to, to get and breed when I played Pokemon Sun and Moon. How much damage we would have initially did because Toxapex have good defense. You know what I haven't done? I haven't, I haven't Dynamaxed uh, Toxtricity actually. What are these pieces of ice? Oh, Bergmite. Yeah, no, we don't care about you guys. Sorry to have bothered you.
Okay, why is everybody out here just chilling? Oh, there's a poster of Marnie over there on the right. I can't eat their, enter Spike Month, so I've been hanging around here this whole time. No one can challenge the dark type leader like this. What's with the gate being shut? How am I supposed to get the gym badge now? Hey, Blades. I'm like, huh? Me? <laughs> did someone call my name? I did not even mean to stop like that. Great. Persecure. I don't want to fight you, dude. Oh, wow. That grass Pokemon's there, that anchor one. I was born here, so I know another way in. If you want to get into the town, how about I show you the way? But you're my rival, so you'll have to beat me in a battle first. Got it? Okay. Oh, and there's the Pokemon Center, too. You've had a pretty good win streak in the gym challenge, just like me. I respect you as my rival and all that, but I got too much at stake to go around losing now. Who are you going to start off with? It's been a, I think it's been a while since we last fought. Okay. What's your team level? I've powered up a whole lot. I'm going to beat you lot into the ground. Got it? 42. Let's just start off with our most powerful uh, electric move. Yeah, wasted your time with that nasty plot. Scrafty. Just so we can get Grim Snarl out there. I think I'll have him do Spirit Break. So we don't need to heal him up at all. And he's about to level up too. Yeah. It's funny because Grimshnarl is like my answer to to um, dark and fighting types. Uh, we are going to leave. Uh, yeah, we're going to leave him out there, Grimshnarl. Yeah, he's literally my answer to her team now. Oh, crap. <laughs> I forgot about his poison weakness. <laughs> See, that's what I get for talking all that smack. <laughs> I knew I should have put Corviknight out there. Heather in the background is cheering with <laughs> the poster of her. Ah, <laughs> oh, you confused me though. I like how hyped up Toxicroak looks though. I have yet to get confused in this game and my Pokemon hit himself. Yeah, because I need I need some heals on Grimmsnarl now. As expected of my rival, you really know how to get me riled up. Ooh, level 44. Here's a special move that I've been saving for just such an occasion. 
spark? You've been saving up spark? I don't know, that's kind of disappointing. Were you... Were you trying to paralyze me? Yeah, I had a feeling she was going to hyper potion her Pokemon. So that just gives us another opportunity to get some health in for Grimmsnarl. Ooh, is that a crit? Yeah, nice. What's with that? My Pokemon didn't get a chance to really do their thing at all. Ugh. My partner, Morpico, has been interested in you and your strength, and I think I get it now. But I've got everyone in Spike Month supporting me. I'm definitely going to get all eight badges just so I can have a rematch with you. Don't you forget it. I'll get my revenge in the Champion Cup. Anyway, I promised I'd show you a way in, so follow me. Okay, this place looks a little run down. Looks like a lot of illegal activity happens over here. Oh wow, they're even chilling in the Pokemon Center. But okay guys, with that said, I'm gonna end this episode off here. Hope you guys enjoyed. We made it to Spike, Spike Month. Yeah, Spike Month. Um, our team's looking pretty beast right now. And we unlocked, uh, basically, water water mode for our bike. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like for the video. Helps out the video a lot. And also subscribe to my channel. Helps out the channel a lot. And with that said, take it easy. Later.